Liverpool have never won a major trophy in their history. So what an opportunity for the League Two side this season in the EFL Trophy. They mix things up from the one all draw with Stevenage. Seven changes, including Tom Crawford, who starts up top alongside Mark Cullen. League One Charlton are having a tough season. Saturday's win over Fleetwood was a step in the right direction. The addicts who are playing in this competition for just the eighth time also chop and change. 18-year-old Mason Burstow, a scorer on Saturday, is one of just four players retained. So both of these sides, two games from Wembley. 16th in League Two against 14th in League One. Positive start for Hartlepool, golden opportunity, it's lofted over the goalkeeper and in. What a start for the underdogs. Joe Gray after just seven minutes. And what a ball through to him as well. Beautifully crafted Hartlepool United goal. The ball was sublime, the finish was inch perfect. Hartlepool won, Charlton Athletic nil. The second goal of the season for Joe Gray. The difference between the two sides at the moment. 18-year-old. What a moment for Gray. Ball, a good season back in League Two. Comfortably mid-table. To the goalkeeper coming out, Ben Killip and Charlton may have a chance here. It's dished back into the area. It might fall nicely for them. It's a good save initially, but it's headed home. And it's Mason Burstow. The youngster who a lot of people are talking about levels things up for Charlton. And it was a poor goal for Hartlepool United to concede. Ben Killip at fault, and then Hartlepool just cannot regroup. It fell kindly for Burstow, but at the second attempt, he heads home. It's his sixth in all competitions this season, and his third in just four games. Hartlepool won, Charlton won. Charlton Athletic well on top now, Mason Burstow coming to the ball again. But uh, they've given the ball away and uh, Tom Crawford has dropped deep. And uh, Hartlepool have looked composed when they've been on the ball, that's for sure. And, uh, this is going to be hit from distance, it was a bobbler. And the goalkeeper McGillivray not exactly convincing. And Charlton can see the corner. Mark Shelton I think was the player who hit this. It was a very decent attempt, just dipped before the goalkeeper and then hooked away by Jason Pierce. The resulting call. This is struck and might have clipped the top of the bar. What an effort that was. Martin Smith unleashing on his left boot. Fell nicely for him. It's a great effort. He's unlucky. down oh and they dawdle on the ball here and eventually scooped it clear but uh, nodded down for Watson lovely pass forwards Charlton building something they spread it out to the right Jonathan Legko scored a 90th minute winner in the last round it's a good looking ball this might fall kindly it's a great swivel and a great finish from Alex Gilby what a game this is, 32 minutes gone, and Charlton have turned things round. Well, Leko, he was the hero in the last match. Great cross, what a finish this is, 2-1 Charlton. League one side, now in charge. proceedings at the moment, they're looking confident on the ball. Only six points above the League One relegation zone. Way off the playoffs, not been a good season at all, but 
Perhaps this run, a run in the EFL Trophy, a trip to Wembley, will do them the world of good. It's clipped into the area, lovely ball. It was asking all kinds of questions, Hartlepool still haven't cleared it. Golden opportunity. I think it was Albie Morgan who hit it. And then out for a corner. But a brilliant ball in. Hartlepool very, very close to going two goals down. Lovely skip and effort from Albie Morgan. Now then, Luke Molyneux. This is the replacement. 20 minutes to go. Hartlepool need to get it at the other end of the field. They're chasing this game. Lovely ball. And it is the substitute, it's Molyneux. Lovely turn, he's played it into Cullen. Cullen goes for goal, great save. Much, much better from Hartlepool United. And Luke Molyneux, what an impact off the bench this is. Great trickery, good pass, really good effort as well from Cullen. McGillivray equal to it. Desperately need a second goal, Hartlepool. At least to take this tie to penalties. Quarter final of the EFL trophy. Molyneux gets it onto his left. What a goal that is! And Hartlepool have leveled things up. And it is the man of the moment, Luke Molyneux. Well, he has made Charlton pay for missed chances. What a finish on his left boot. What an impact off the bench by the boss, Graham Lee. And a sub finish. It's his sixth of the season. 17 minutes to go. And it's game on. It's Hartlepool United 2, Charlton Athletic 2. Just a couple of minutes after coming off the bench. So far the win. Hartlepool in the ascendancy at the moment. Will they be happy with penalties or do they fancy it to winning this in normal time? It's taken a deflection and they might just win it still in normal time. Corner kick. To nobody in particular, but it's going to be struck from distance and it's. A couple of yards over the bar. It was dipping. Great delivery. Not really attacking it to begin with. Not at all unlucky. Not at all still in the FA Cup as well. A fourth round tie at Palace to come. And they are still in the EFL Trophy. They have taken League One Charlton to penalties. And it will be spot kicks. Really entertaining match this. 2 2 after 90. Connor Washington for Charlton Athletic. Gets them off the mark. They leave one side ahead in the shootout. Mark Cullen to level things up for Hartlepool. He does exactly that. Confident penalty. It's Gilby. Sends the keeper the wrong way. 2-1 Charlton. And this is Crawford. Another confident penalty. Four spot kicks, four goals. And this is the substitute, Sean Clare. Steers it home. Mark Shelton had that effort in the first half. And that's a beautiful penalty. It's three apiece. No misses yet. And this is Lee. He's missed. What a save that is. Ben Killett, the hero for Hartlepool. It's Molyneux. Hartlepool are on the brink. 4 3 to Pools. Chuck Sanike. He saves Charlton. They are still in it. Just for all. 
This is going to be Jamie Sterry to send Hartlepool into the semi-finals. And he does exactly that. The dream is still alive. They have never won a major trophy. They are one game away from a place at Wembley. Hartlepool United are through. They have not charted out. 2-2 after 90 minutes, 5-4 on spot kicks. What a match in the northeast. East. And we're celebrating. There's the hero. Hartlepool are through.